you're still watching Power Breakfast on CNBC TV 18. Vedanta Resources founder and chairman Anil Agrawal is extremely confident about Vedanta's financial health. Speaking exclusively to CNBC TV 18's Nigel D'Souza, Agrawal said with $30 billion in revenue and $9 billion in profits, Vedanta has enough internal accrual to repay debt and even raise fresh funds. Anil Agrawal urged the government to divest its residual stake in Hindustan Zinc, saying the promise was made 20 years ago. Here's a slice of that conversation. Now, the proposal of Hindustan Zinc to go ahead and buy international Zinc's assets, well, the government of India seems to have opposed it at least as of now. But you have said and your spokespeople have said that you all are in discussions and best for the shareholders and for all stakeholders will be done. So what's the plan B out here? Will you be looking at a share swap, uh, you know, another way of getting this deal done? Is there a plan B? I want Hindustan Zinc by itself. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking yes. that the way the scope is, we can make it, Hindustan Zinc, today is a $20 billion company. Mm -hmm. We can double it in no time. Right. But we have, Zinc is a scarce community. And it, Zinc is required for a today's environment because naked steel you can't use. Correct. You have to use galvanized steel. And we produce silver. Silver is a very, very important uh, um, uh, commodity for, for, um, for everything. Yeah. So we need to grow and we got this asset which is under the same umbrella yes same umbrella and today how hindustan zinc is running because we have all the talent from the south africa yes. we don't have mining talent so we got all the talent from south africa and this hodgepodge hmm. li huge leakage if you can put these two companies together the company two and two going to be six not four right so that was the whole idea because we have big, bigger asset bigger asset than the Hindustan Zinc. Uh, we did a very conservative valuation. Hmm. And the money which is lying in Hindustan Zinc, we are getting return of 2 to 3%. Yes. If we take um, uh, South African asset, which is a producing asset, right. profit-making asset, if they put them together, the return is almost 17-18%. It is the right move. I am saying why government has agreed that we will sell 100% share. 20 years back. No, how much you hold us our leg hmm. not to run, run? They have to take a decision to disinvest this 29%. Yes. If they, there is a clear cut agreement that um, uh, they will be divesting to us at, with a particular formula, and government can get probably. Um, 50,000 crore, 40,000 crore, yeah. and they want to do it, but we, they have to accelerate. If they go away, then we can run our company. Board has, company has to run by the board, yes. not by the government.